Chances are you may have scrolled past Kyrie Irving's girlfriend on Instagram. Hello and welcome to The Fumble here in LA. I'm Crystal Rich. Click the subscribe button below to stay up to date on everything sports and to join our notification squad. And you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Crystal Rich. Kyrie Irving is about to make his first ever film debut in Uncle Drew and it's only right that he has a girl on his arm on the red carpet, right? Well, we think we may know who he's back dating. Chantel Jeffries is an Instagram model and DJ and back in 2016, her and Irving were rumored to be dating. In 2016, the duo were spotted together at a rooftop pool day party where Jeffries was spinning. They were spotted again recently and the rumor is that Kyrie flew out to Miami to see her spin. People at the party said they were dancing together and very flirty. Party goers said Kyrie was obviously there to see her. Both of them reportedly left for dinner together afterwards. Chantel is seen with a lot of famous men so it's hard to tell who was friend zone and who she's actually dating. She's been spotted with P. Diddy's son Justin Combs, Deshaun Jackson, the weekend, and she was just with Joel MB. Right there, that's us. Hold up now. Wait. You may most remember her for being in the car while Justin Bieber got arrested for a DUI. I don't like the storyline that she has to be dating all these guys though. They could straight up be in the friend zone for all we know. Kyrie Sane was also in the media again, but not because of a woman. Cavs owner Dan Gilbert recently tweeted out that the Cavs wouldn't be in the finals without the Kyrie trade. In his three part tweet he said, Cavs fans despite multiple challenges we have arrived at the NBA finals for the fourth year in a row with the opportunity to win our second ring in three years. The biggest three reasons among many. We are here again in Oakland a few minutes from the tip off of game one of the finals are number one, LeBron James. No words describe his level of play and commitment to his game. His impact is magical. We go as he goes. Number two, the dedication and underlying belief of Kevin Love, Tristan Thompson, JR, Corver, Green, Hill, Larry, Clarkson, Seti, Ante, Perk, and every other player on this roster. And number three, trade 1.0 last summer and trade 2.0 at the deadline led by a humble team, young GM, Kobe Altman. Without either of these two bold moves orchestrated by Kobe and the Cavs front office, we would not be here with a chance to bring another one home to Cleveland. That actually goes against what LeBron recently said that he didn't like the Cavs trading away Kyrie Irving. Do you think the Cavs are really in a better spot without him? I don't, but let me know your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching The Fumble, I'm Crystal Rich.